I bought the property in 1978, but the actual park where we started planting the first trees and improving wasn't until 82. We started it just for a bunch of Marines from, that made a commitment to each other in Vietnam. And we were referred to as the Kool-Aid Kids because we drank Kool-Aid and toasted to each other so that if any of us survived, we wouldn't let the others be forgotten. And Camp Hamilton uh, is the result of that commitment. At first, it wasn't called Camp Hamilton. It was called Camp Marine. And for the first few years, it was just for Marines. And uh, I kept it kind of close because it was personal to me. But after we started getting more and more volunteers and more and more veterans coming out, and they, they wanted to be part of it. And as they did, I thought that was wonderful that they wanted to remember veterans and, and, and uh, carry on with the, the attitude that we had building the park. So we opened it up to other services. And soon we opened it up, we opened it up to all wars, all services. Since then, we've had lots of volunteers and there's no way that I could have done Camp Hamilton by myself. We pay the most deepest of gratitude to the veterans who are memorialized here. Uh, as long as somebody's reading their name and, and looking at their tree, they're never forgotten.